Good evening, everybody. This is March 3rd, 2021, and this is now episode 7 of Dinner Breaks. Um, tonight, I'm joined with my son, Sam. Um, tonight, we got a unique kind of break going on. We're celebrating celebrities and Star Wars together tonight. So tonight's break is going to have three boxes, Star Wars Signature Series, one in case card per box. I've got one box here of 2015 Panini Americana. So lots of celebrity possibilities in here, autographs or memorabilia. And I've also got a mail day package from Dynasty Breaks came in today. Um, hopefully this is my Star Wars signatures that I've received from them um, the last week from another group break that I was part of. Um, so hopefully we get some good pulls tonight and have a little bit of fun. Sam's just going to join me long enough tonight to open up the Star Wars and my package from Dynasty Breaks. And what we're going to do is we're going to have him start off by opening up my package from Dynasty Breaks while I get into the Americana. And once we're done with the Americana and the Star Wars Signature Series tonight, I have one box of 2020 Tops Star Wars Holocron Series. Guarantee one autograph per box. We're going to look in there and see what we get. So we're going to go ahead and break the seal on the Americana here real quick. So 10 packs, five cards per pack, and guaranteed four either autograph or memorabilia cards out of the 10 packs. There are 73 um, subjects in the set, including uh, this one has people like Hulk Hogan, Kevin Hart, also some Kentucky Derby uh, winning trainers and jockeys. So your guess is as good as mine, folks, as we start to get in here with this one. <clears throat> so let's we'll start here with the Americana, first pack. So we'll start to go through these a little bit quickly here. Nice little screen legends, Lana Turner, Mickey Rooney, Steve Sharippa. This one was turned around backwards, so hopefully we get something good. And we have an autograph. Right out of the first pack tonight. Um, let's see here. Secret Life of the American Teenager. Nikki Deuce series. And the autobiographical parenting guide, Big Daddy's Rules. I'm sure there's other things he's been a part of, too, but... Those are the most notable ones at the time that these cards were put out. Gonzalez, Latoya Jackson. So, we go right along here. <clears throat> he said all 73 celebrities have something inside here. So, there's possibility of anybody from their checklist going to be in here. Bradley Cooper. Oh, Vanilla Ice. Certified Silver Singles. You got to love these one-hit wonders. Now, he actually had two hits, but we don't count the, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles song. <laughs> Daryl McDaniels from Run DMC. Eva Marie, the former WWE diva. Moving right along here. You know, this is a this is a very good set. Over the years, the Panini Americana has turned into have something, you know, be kind of interesting, fun, unique. And you never quite know what you're gonna pull out here. A little die cut on the tube, John McKinley. McGinley, sorry. Jaleel White, Don't Call Me Urkel. You know, Kevin Hart. So we're moving right along here. There you go, Vanilla Ice. Screen Legends, Dorothy Lamour, Jimmy Stewart. Yeah, I love these old school. Oh, look at another, another autograph here. 
Danica McKellar. Oh my goodness gracious. I remember more from, I believe, the Wonder Years. Um, nice little show that came out in the 90s, when I was, late 80s, early 90s, when I was a younger person there. Al Pacino, Shannon Elizabeth. So we got two hits so far. Just a few more packs to go. There's Molly Ringwald. Little Kelly Rowland. Have a winner circle combo. So it's rare to see you know, the Bob Baffert on a car on a trading card. Nick Cannon. All right, here we go. Oh, got something big coming up. It's a nice thick card. Oh, double die cuts. Jane Russell, Tiffany Thiessen. So we got old school and new newer school here. Then we got here. Let's see. Terrence Jenkins, actor on the tube, number to four ninety nine. Little piece of memorabilia there. Um, Stomp the yard two burlesque. Think like a man. Think like a man too. So he's had a pretty good go there. So it's three down, one to go. Got four packs left. There we go. Actor Robert Mitchum. We have a freeze frame. Julia Gonzalo. That's very neat. Kind of a nice little see-through acetate. Almost looks like it's a piece of film there. There goes Slade Smiley. All right. Let's see. Daphne Oz. Terrence Jenkins. Uh, Hedy Lamar, not to be confused with Hedley Lamar, Hedley Lamar, the character portrayed by uh, Harvey Corman in Blazing Saddles. And here we go, a winning circle. Kentucky Derby and Preakness winner Gary Stevens and Bob Baffert. Dual memorabilia. Number 299. Sylvester Stallone, MC Light. Um, here we go. We got two car. Got two packs left to go here. So let's see if we have any more luck. Have a surprise. Have a nice little surprise come up here and get us at some point. DB Sweeney, Biz Marquee. Have a blue. Looks like a parallel. Mickey Rourke. Not numbered. We have Kelly Rowland and Dana McKellar. And then, let's see our last pack on the Panini Americana. I just, I just like the, you know, the, the, the variety of selection. Hopefully we can find something here in this last couple. Another Vanilla Ice. Another Blue Parallel. DJ Jazzy Jeff. Here we go. And that ends out our box of the Panini Americana. Overall, not a, not a bad little selection there. Kind of a variety of celebrities. Um, not, not too upset at all for a quick find, just for the little one box. So now we're moving on to here to Sam, who got open up my Dynasty Breaks um, cards here. Um, the ones I got from the uh, from the uh, from their group break the other night 
Warwick Davis as Wicket W. Warwick, the Ewok. And then one who is a real surprise here. Um, this one's numbered to 50. Salute. And the actor's signature is Tom Kenny. This is a little bit different from being a pine, if he lives in a pineapple under the sea, isn't it? Mm -hmm. The same actor, voice actor for SpongeBob, also did voice act work for Star Wars. Isn't that nice? Or how about that? So that's a pleasant little surprise there. So we got three boxes now of Star Wars Signature Series. Sam, hand me the boxes tonight as he unwraps them. Inside each box is one autograph card. So let's see who we get here. Um, Moralo Eval, number 99. Shaped by Stephen Stanton from the, one of the animated series for our first one. And then on to number two. I saw you smiling when you saw that name, Tom Kenny, Sam. <laughs> oh, mama. This is one that I love. Um, we actually met this actor at Star Wars Celebration 2 many, many years ago. But um, he reprised his role in the Star Wars... Rebels animated series as young Boba Fett, Daniel Logan. Number to 99. And that is just a really sweet thing. Uh, one of three different actors to play the role of Boba Fett. The others being Tamora Morrison, who's also uh, reprised his role as Boba Fett in the Mandalorian series. And Jeremy Bullock, who was the original actor in the armor during um, Star Wars Return of the Jedi. And also Empire Strikes Back. So here we go. The last box, Star Wars Signature Series. This one's not going to be numbered. But Jedi Master Plo Koon. And we'll see here if it's supposed to be from the animated series. Reb uh, or James Arnold Taylor is Plo Koon, the voice actor from the Clone Wars series. So that's not a bad little selection of autographs, is it, Sam? He's being quite vocal tonight. <laughs> so I want to thank Sam for taking a few extra minutes tonight to open up a few with me tonight just to help things along. And hopefully we can get him when he's not half asleep and we can have a little bit more of a conversation. But, you know, you'd be surprised at all the people that have had their, their roles in Star Wars over the years. So now I'm going to go here. i got this one box left of the Holocron series. Sam, thank you for stepping in tonight and helping out. Um, so Holocron is going to be a fun one to get into here. Not too many packs. Looks to be about 18 packs in here total. Eight cards per pack. Nothing else inside there. I'm going to try to go with these really quickly. What we're looking for is our variation cards, our autographs. And just trying to see what kind of... It's a pretty good list of all the characters that are from Star Wars. Have a green parallel, Queen Amidala. Nice little silver foil, General Leia Organa. Alderaan. So, we'll try to go with these a little bit more quickly here. Uh, so, the, the uh, Holocron sets, a little bit of everything from all the way across Star Wars. Just to kind of show you, down here, a couple green parallels. 
Little Anakin Skywalker lightsaber. Um, I was gonna say, it's got a little bit of everything from all the way up, from all across the Star Wars movies. A lot of character bios. Yoda, foil Darth Vader. Got some scenes from the classic trilogy. So now they did say there are possibilities of some uh, redemption cards throughout this one as well. So if I see an all blue card, we know what we know what we're looking at here. Old, old, young Han Solo, old Han Solo. Right along here, classic Boba Fett. <clears throat> IG-11, not to be confused with IG-88. So there are some Mandalorian um, cards in here as well. So hopefully we can find something that just makes us go wow here before we finish out this box of cards and end our video for the night. Here we go, starting to get, starting to run out of packs. Not having too much luck here trying to find that one autograph card that could be in here. I said, just growing up with Star Wars and introducing my kids to Star Wars early was just a wonderful experience for us. Um, you know, always more of the classic trilogy fan, the animation. So, anytime I get an opportunity to find something like this to open up, and we have our autograph. Commander Dane Jeer. You know what? This is from the original opening scenes of A New Hope. He is the Imperial officer who was walking with Lord Vader when he found out they captured Princess Leia in the very beginning, when he said, holding her could be dangerous. Actor's name, Al Lampert, and that is numbered to 306. Always number your cards to 306, right, Sam? <laughs> so, we'll end up bagging that one up here in a minute. So I've still got a few more packs left to go here. I said, just when they have all these different actors over the years, you never know what you're going to get, who you're going to find, um, what other roles they've gone into or played previously. Um, so got a few more left to go. Not too much left. I love the classic scenes. All the different lightsabers. Um, let's get some characters from the animation. Down to our final six. Sam, would you like to open a couple packs? 
All right, we'll go the shoulder shrug. So it's a yes. You know, because you never know. Sometimes they'll slip in an extra one on you. Um, so it's, a, it's a, at least one autograph per boxes. So. Bill Burr's Mayfield. That man is hilarious. So we're down to our final couple. So Sam's been pretty quiet still, so he hasn't found anything autographed. We go along here. Two D two. Oh, I got one turned around backwards. Charting the Galaxy, this one's going to be numbered to 99. And it is just a variation. The Planet Camino. Commander Cody. Sith Trooper. You know, Commander Cody. wonder if he had, what he ever did with his Hot Rod Lincoln. Sorry, that's a music joke. And so, so no autographs on yours, Sam? Nothing tonight. All right, so we'll go through quick here. All right, so you know I have to say I'm not disappointed at all in the uh, the uh, Star Wars um, signature cards tonight. Uh, but some pleasant surprises there. And I'd like to thank everybody for uh, taking the time out to watch us tonight. Uh, so this is video ran a little bit longer than I thought it would, but I do appreciate everybody who joined us tonight. Or we're going to watch us later on. And we, oh, we did have one left surprise pack here. Let's see. There we go. IG88. Plenty of Chewbacca. Thin. Here we go. Millennium Falcon's new owner from the Han Solo standalone movie. So, folks, uh, hopefully, uh, we got to see some pretty cool stuff tonight. Um, I didn't know what to expect getting into these cards. Some of the autographs are really sweet. Uh, so, you just never know what's out there until you open it up. So, I take this time, folks, to wrap things up tonight. Um, have a wonderful evening. God bless you all. And um, hopefully we get to do some more um, opening up here in the near future. Uh, once again, I want to thank Dynasty Breaks for giving me the opportunity tonight to show off a couple more uh, really unique autograph cards. Um, folks, if you like them, go to DynastyBreaks.com. Dane, George, Trevor, those guys do an excellent job of everything they do. Provide some entertainment and some very affordable breaks that can really surprise you in the end. So um, I'm going to go ahead and sign off for the night. Have a wonderful evening. And he said, just keep breaking, just keep breaking, and you never know what's good, what you might find.